Hey guys, what's up? Welcome and welcome back to my channel, LaMonica's Lab, if you're new. Today in the lab, I'm gonna be going over the elephant in the room, which is this new hair that I have here in my head. This is a crochet look. I asked you guys if you wanted to see some crochet looks here on my channel, you guys definitely gave me some votes for that, so thank you to each and every one of you who contributed to the votes. I usually ask you guys polls and questions like that in the community tab, so definitely look out in the community, look out in the community tab so that you can like be a part of the voting and things like that on what I put on my channel. So if you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We definitely want to add you to the fam bam and I'll greatly appreciate it. And if you like crochet hair videos and reviews and things like that, then give this video a thumbs up. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into the video. All right, you guys. So first I want to thank each and every one of you for giving me birthday wishes throughout the weekend. I definitely appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so, so much. So that is hence why I have this new hairdo. It's definitely out of my comfort zone, but I wanted to do something a little bit different for my birthday. So that's why I did this particular look. It is different for me. It's an 18 inch um, crochet style. Let me take the card up the pack. So I have in the Afri Natural pre-stretch Caribbean bundle braids. This is the cascading ripple 18 inch. And some people call this the main concept hair, but I got this from my local beauty supply store. This is what it looks like. And again, I have it in the cascade rippling, cascade ripple 18 inch. I do have a pack left and this is what it looked like. It was $6.99 at my local beauty supply store. And this is what the curls look like. I've had this in for two whole days now um, and I've just been like playing with it, like roughing it up. I will say that the back of it is starting to like stick together and one just fell out here on camera so I'll, I will get into that. So with this hair, because it's super soft, you definitely need to like triple, quadruple loop your hair. I looped each of the strands of hair three times, two to three times, depending on where it was located. But this is what one strand of hair will look like. The curl is gorgeous. The hair feels amazing. But you do have to um, lock it a few times so that it won't slide out, as that just did, as I was showing you guys on camera. But like I was saying, in the back, it does tend to like stick together. I haven't put any product on this hair just yet. No mousse, just water. And I still, I still like the curls. This is what it is. I did a braiding method where I can like switch my part up if I wanted to. So this is like in the middle. If I decide to do that, if I wanted to switch it and put it on this side. Then I can do that. I'm gonna put it back on this side for now because that's the way that I liked it so I have it in a side part and I will insert a clip where I show you guys my braiding pattern so you'll see the gist of what it looks like under the hair this is what it's looking like all around so it's pretty long pretty long for me haven't tried any long hair in a long time, in a very long time. So I was excited to try this. I actually wanted to try this in the shade T1B30, but my beauty supply store ran out of that shade. So that's why I just ended up getting 1B. And I actually have the number one right at the back of the neck, at the very bottom, one pack of one. I purchased five packs. I've only used four. So like I said, I have a pack left. But I feel like this hair will be perfect if you're interested in doing like half up, half down looks for crochet looks. You can cut it up if you want. I really do like the curl pattern, which is what drew me to it in the first place. Also, my girl, Leah LaVon, if you haven't followed her or watched her crochets, that's what her channel is about, crochet hair. I'll link her channel down below, but she always makes these crochet hairstyles look so beautiful. So I watched a few videos and then I just narrowed it, narrowed it down to... A curl pattern that I wanted to do so there are a few that I want to try from this brand but this is the brand that I tried for the first time it is a Remy fiber so that's probably why it's a bit softer than like 
crochet hair that I've had before. I do have another crochet hair review here on my channel. I'll put that in the, in the description box or in the cards above so you guys can check out that as well. But so far, so good. Like I said, I only had it in for two days. It does tend to uh, loosen up because this is a soft strand of hair. So you just want to make sure you tighten that up when you're tightening them. And then also in the back, like I said, some of the loose strays are just um, sticking together. So this is what's currently happening when you're like playing around with the hair. You get some hair that's just going to come out, but not that much. But this is how much I keep getting when I'm like rubbing my hands through and just taking out that excess hair i did cut some of the pieces so maybe that's why i'm getting a little bit more shedding because i wanted to frame the front of my face but this is all the hair here brought up to the front and i really like the curl i feel like when it gets older i'll probably like it a little bit more which i typically do with crochet styles for me I feel like they look a, a bit more realistic. Um, this is not a shiny hair, but like I said, it is a soft, rimmy type of hair. So I like the curl pattern so, so much. So I definitely would like to try this in another shade or color, but so far so good. You can wear it in multiple ways. Like I said, I just parted my hair the way you guys saw and did that. I probably wear this for, try to wear it for at least the rest of this month and give you guys some updates uh, via Instagram or in the comment section of this video. So let me know what you guys think down below. If you tried this hair before, if you're interested in trying crochets, if you guys want me to continue to do crochet looks, actually comment down below if you want me to do an actual, like showing you how I actually install my crochet looks or if you just prefer me to review the hair first impressions and then keep you guys updated on the con in the comment section but nevertheless all the information about this hair will be in the description box below and so far so good like I said just keep in mind to tighten this hair because it does slide out the curl pattern is amazing but it does tend to slide out because of its softness of the hair and yeah I feel like four packs would do do you justice if you have a larger size head like myself. It only took me four packs. If you're going for a more like bigger look, then you may want to get five to six packs. If you want less hair than what I have, you probably can get away with three packs. So that's my opinion on that. And again, like I said, this is the Afri Natural Main Concept, I think. That's what it said on the little mannequin in the store. Pre-stretch Caribbean bundle braids. It's the Cascading Ripple 18, and that is what that is here. So, comment down below what you guys think. Um, this, like I said, this is new for me. This long hair, but we shall see how I like it. But nevertheless, I hope you guys enjoyed this simple review of this hair and my thoughts. And we'll keep talking in regards to the to the hair in the remaining of this month in the comment section. So make sure you are subscribed, turn your notification bell on so that you can know what we're talking about in the comment section. And yeah, until next time, love, peace, and beauty. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.